Hi! Welcome to my video. Today I'll be showing you how to make slime and I'll be reviewing this product which is called Slime Mermaid Slimey Goo. So this is a two in one video which is going to be so cool. So this is my first one. So this is $1.99 by the way. So it says it includes all of these stuff. So, one plastic spoon, one mixing stick, one measuring cup, glitter, one disodium titobolate, which is like the activator, a white glue, which is 40 ml, and then two coloured dyes, and then it's got an instruction manual, because you know what to do. So, this is for 8 plus. And it says it includes magical stars, but let's see what it is. You can create your own, so you can mix the colours and do whatever you want. So let's open it! It's not glued down or anything, all you have to do is open it. And when you open it, you find this cover. So the box is empty. And then when you open it, it's like this instruction manual. I'll put it this inside. It's in black and white though, just not very good. But hang on. So it tells you what it is, which I read down at the back of here. And then it has the instructions. So you have to cover your workspace, but this is this is made for that, so I'm not doing that. And then you have to measure and pour 20 ml of the glue and then into the cup that they gave you, which is over here. And then you just add your colouring, which is just over here. They, they gave you two of them. And then you're going to just add the activator, mix it, and then you made it. It doesn't tell you how much to add of your activator or anything, but you have to store it in a reusable or sealed container or bag so yeah this is the gold glitter it says it includes magical stars but it doesn't really it's not like the stars it's just a teeny bit of glitter and then it's got this tiny packet of glue you can use your own if you want but i'm just using this it says these are food eyes but they're really not they're just paint so it's purple and blue. Activator. A spoon. It's plastic, by the way. A teeny tiny cup. And a lolly stick. So let's make it. First, you have to get the cup, like it says, and pour. 20 ml. I'm not doing 20 ml, I'm just doing 10 because I'm going to mix the colours together at the end. So, just open this and then you have to pull it out. You strong muscles! <coughs> I nearly opened it. You might need some help, but I don't. I just pour 10 ml. It's got the numbers on the side, if you can see it just a tiny bit uh. how do you get this off I'm just doing it like that because there's no really other way to get it off so if I look at it there's still not 10 so there I, now I know what the lolly stick is for so when you do it you're just going to scrape it off clever me This is really hard to squeeze the glue out. This is like some elastic or something. I don't know. And this doesn't feel like glue. It's kind of lumpy, but yeah. So I'm just gonna take it off. It's already like slime if you want to know. So there. This is like 15, so yeah. It doesn't really matter though. So I'm just gonna place it on here. Make sure to sleeve it or it'll go all dry and you can't use it anymore, which is kind of bad. So and then I'm going to add my pre-curry, 
So, which one do you think I'm going to use? I'm going to use the purple because my second favorite color. I'm going to try and open it. There. And then you're just going to add two or three drops. I'm just, I just have to use the other side of the spoon or something. This is so satisfying. So, if you see it. There. You don't have to add much of this because it's like really. Nice. So, if you could see it, it looks really cool. So, then you're just going to get the activator. You can mix it in like I am. So, I'm going to mix it in just to like get the colour out. You don't have to though. I'm going to try and open it. The activator is here. So it's sealed. I'm going to open it and add a teeny bit there. And then I'm just going to mix it in with the other side of my spoon. It's already time to turn into a tiny slimy texture. Uh, it sounds so weird. You can add some glitter if you want, but I'm gonna just mix this in really well first. So I'm still mixing it, and it's actually coming together. And how do you know it's coming together? It's easy. All you need to do is just like put the spoon in and take it out. As you can see, it's kind of stringy. It's really messy. It makes this funny noise when you do it. It's almost like farting. I don't think you can hear it, but it's really weird. As you mix it, there should be bubbles popping out. Because that means it's ready. Don't put your fingers in. They could get sticky. You should only put your fingers in when you're like quite sure that it's ready. It's still this little bit mixing. But you know, like, you have to go in your hands sometimes because you have to get messy when you're making slime. Ugh, it's got all the hands. As you can see, you only need like two drops of paint because it gets kind of dark. It depends on what kind of purple you want. I want it kind of dark. Can you see it, guys? Oh, so cool. So, I'm gonna just going to touch it, it's still kind of sticky, so keep on mixing it, mix, 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 it's hard but I guess it's worth the time, mix, okay I'm just going to go in my hands now because I can't be bothered to mix it anymore, see there's bubbles in it, I still think I need a tiny bit more activator. Make sure you don't add too much activator or the slime will just go. Yeah, it's actually coming together really quickly. The activator that you don't need stays at the bottom, so you can always like add some more PVA and make a different colour of it. Oh wow, it's coming together really quickly. So now I know what to do next time, add more activator. So as you can see, it's actually clumped together to make really cool glue. So I keep on mixing it until... Ta-da! So it shouldn't stick to the spoon. It should stick to your hand for a couple of minutes, but then once you play with it, it should get better. So I'm going to just put the spoon again. Hopefully it comes out really well this time. Ooh. As you can see... It came out well. Don't make the slime too dry or it won't really stretch. The fun part of slime is that it's sticky. The more you play with it, the more you have fun. So, thanks for watching my video. Bye!